As a result of this investigation, we have a family who's going to be celebrating the holidays and they won't have an empty chair. Tonight, a 12 year old Fresno after she was abducted by a Virginia man who tried to fly her across the country. Good evening, I'm Kirsten Mitchell. The man was arrested in Denver during a layover. Now, this investigation started Monday when the Fresno County Sheriff's Office received a report of a missing girl. They linked her to linked her abduction to a 40-year-old man from Virginia who had been talking to the child on social media and flew to Fresno to get her. As our Angelica Leilani explains, authorities describe the man as a white supremacist and a pedophilia advocate. A Virginia man is behind bars in Denver, Colorado, after authorities say the man, 40-year-old Nathan Larson, allegedly kidnapped a 12-year-old Fresno girl on Monday. Sheriff Margaret Mann says the two met on social media in mid-October, and then Larson flew out to Fresno to get her. He persuaded her to sneak out of her house at around 2 in the morning. He used a rideshare company to pick her up, and together they rode to the Fresno airport. The two then boarded a plane headed to Washington, D.C. with a layover in Denver. Larson made her wear a long hair wig to alter her appearance and make her look older. He also told her to act as though she was disabled and una unable to speak to ensure she would not converse with anyone at the airport. Thanks to partnerships with multiple law enforcement agencies, authorities in Denver were able to arrest Larson and rescue the girl, now back home with family in Fresno. During a search of Larson's Virginia home, authorities seized electronic devices unraveling what Mims calls a deeply disturbing background. He is a white supremacist and a well-known advocate for pedophilia. This is a man who runs a website which encourages the raping of children and sharing of naked photos and video of children being raped. In 2009, Larson served 14 months in federal prison after sending a detailed email to the Secret Service threatening to kill the president. In 2017, Larson ran for Virginia House of Delegates and lost. Part of his platform was to change the laws to allow for incestual relationships and sex with minors. Officials believe there may be more victims out there and ask them to come forward. Larson faces several felony charges in Fresno County. He's scheduled for a court hearing in Denver on December 24th. Sheriff Mim says at that time they will request to extradite Larson back to Fresno. Angelica Leilani, CBS 47 Eyewitness News.